Hi everyone. I've been using Plex for quite some time. I mainly use it on my local area network for sharing my uh, home pictures and uh, home family videos, my DVD collection, uh, playing music, etc. And I've always liked Plex because it's always been kind of user protected, uh, protective orientated, if, if you like. Always in the early days, communications were all about uh, protecting your privacy and only um, collecting information necessary to make sure the platform uh, worked efficiently and to fix any bugs. But I discovered recently that uh, there, there's quite a bit of information that's being collected that I don't remember opting into. And it seems like you have to opt out uh, rather than opt in. I always think for our privacy and data collection, it should be an opt in feature. Uh, but it seems uh, Plex have changed things that you now have to opt out. And I also uh, found it difficult to find uh, the buttons for you to opt out and to, and to see what uh, information was being collected. So I thought this would be quite an important video, uh, A, to let you know that you need to opt out and also where to find these features. I'm going to leave a couple of links in the video description uh, where you can find your privacy preferences and your email preferences because it's really not easy to find. So first thing you want to do is make sure you're logged in to your account and then click on uh, the links in the video description and it will take you to the page uh, for these various settings. So first of all, let's look at the privacy uh, settings page. So first of all, my impression here is this doesn't look like that you're uh, in the Plex uh, app, if you like. So it's very different format. It looks more like a, a blog, but it's not. So I really would encourage you to scroll down and look at the amount of information and personal information that's being collected. So account information, for example, uh, your network, session data, TV program guide, playback data. There's a whole list of data that's being collected about you and how you use the Plex service. You've got to scroll a long way down and here you'll see two boxes and they've already been checked. So this first one is sending back all of that information that we've just scrolled through uh, back to Plex. So you want to uncheck that and then advertising data. So this is sharing information about how you use the service uh, to feed adverts to you. So you wanna uncheck that as well. There is nowhere to save those settings. It just automatically updates. So if you wanna leave the page and come back, you'll find that they've remained unchecked. And then the next link again in the description is to email preferences. So again, here, uh, Plex has decided to, without asking me, opt me in to all of these marketing emails. So I'm getting newsletter, product news, recommended movies, sales promotions, and then discover emails. It's going to email me when someone sends me a message, for example, friend request, summary of my friend's activity. I think that's wrong as well. Uh, so I'm going to unsubscribe to all of those and then update my preferences. Uh, you might want to receive some of those, but by default, I don't think that they should have all been clicked. So I've unclicked those. So that was just a quick email. I thought you'd want to know. I hadn't realized that, that I needed to opt out of all these things. And I'm pretty sure that these uh, these uh, privacy and preferences were not there in the early days of Plex. But uh, I could be wrong. But they are now. So uh, if you don't do anything else, I think this is one thing that you should do if you're a Plex user like me, is make sure that you, you review all of those privacy preferences and uh, personal information that Plex will otherwise be collecting on you. Anyway, I hope that helps. If it does, please consider subscribing. It really helps me out and also maybe hitting that notification button so we see each other in future videos. Take care, everyone.